focus area uh, of historical Jesus studies and the resurrection of Christ. Uh, and so I, I just pick on Richard Carey there because I know a little bit about him, but there are other scholars that I could talk about. The point is this, that in the debate, N.T. Wright brings these issues about the way first century Judaism is and the sudden change from the first century Judaism into the metamorphosis of Christianity and the skeptic needs to grapple with this and answer it and they use the wrong methodology very often but they don't deal with the data that's the point that I'm trying to get at the data is not honestly assessed and if it was honestly assessed there would be some serious serious thinking to be done uh, about why there was an empty tomb why the early church said they saw Jesus rise from the dead and I think you uh, as a person a skeptic and as a Christian owe it to yourself to grapple and to study uh, the scholarship on the resurrection of Christ and, and to get to grips to that and so that you're clear either why you believe or why you reject uh, and I think that this debate if you listen to this debate it will help you on your way I thoroughly enjoyed it two uh, really good people uh, and uh, I would encourage you to to go and listen to it that's all I have to say on this I hope that's been a blessing to you and a help to you today okay so that was just off the cuff of my head um, so uh, I'll see if I can uh... <laughs> I'm going to um, give you uh, Excuse me. Okay. Um, I'm going to just link for you um, this article. Uh, it's called Survey of Historical Jesus Studies from Ramirez to Wright by Dr. Michael Burr is Assistant Professor of New Testament Studies at Dallas Theological Seminary. You can get this article at biblebible.org article. Okay, uh, And that will help you to get started on historical Jesus studies. And he'll have lots of references that you can go and read. Okay, So I'd encourage you to... Uh, 